So I could breed the cow, birth the calf, wean the calf, go to the feedlot with them, and sell them at the end of that, and I stay in the same program with adjusted prices. Yes, yes, there'll be, there'll be two different, actually you could do three. You could do, uh, there's unborn calf. Yep. So let's take these calves right here. I know there's, they're, they got calves on them now. Let's say this fall on another group of cows, if you had some fall cows, calvers, you can do an unborn calf policy on them. Okay. okay. As long as your target weight is below 600 pounds, and you, you plan on selling them before 600 pounds, you can actually do a unborn policy for steers and heifers. So let's say if, they, if you calve there in November and you plan on selling them next March or April, May, you can, you can do an insurance policy for them unborn calves to protect that uh, price, that okay. market price. So I've got guarantees five ways to Sunday. Yes. On uh, at your expense, and uh, you take the risk. That's why you call it risk protection. That is correct.